God! Ugh! Man, that scared me. No wonder you said you're ready and you looked. I was like, why are you pausing? This tool. That thingy. Do we have this one? It's a clutch and a bobber. It's a, yeah. It's that one. Anyway. Okay, so here's what's going on. We have a trip to Glamis. We purchased a brand new razor. We do not have a brand new razor. I'm starting to get annoyed. Hey guys, this is some older content. We have been super busy. We had the Turbo S blow up. We had clutch issues. We had trips to get ready for. Anyway, here is some content that's a little bit older that I still wanted to get out because it covers some of the clutch issues we've been fighting with. And it covers uh, some people that have helped us out along the way and we appreciate it so much. So here you go. Polaris is not to blame at all. And also the people I've talked to about Polaris, because you know, yeah. they have a procedure they follow, but I talked to them today. Dustin was awesome on the phone. Um, it's, uh, Michaela's always been great. Danny was great. Uh, the tech working on the case it has updated and escalated. So tomorrow we'll have more information. But, but, um, well, but here's the thing. Somebody mentioned <sighs> uh, metal in the oil pulling the motor. Yeah, so 50 miles in, they're, they're pulling motor. Not, no bueno. Metal debris in the oil. Not good. Engine's blown, I bet. Like, there's some problems happening. All right, anyway. But anyways. So, moving on. Yeah. Now we got to fix this car, but this is something we can do ourselves. Uh, update on the Can-Am. So, I put some rollers in. I think I put junk rollers in, but that's not really the problem. <laughs> I just was filling them just now, and they feel uh, maybe like they're a little bit flat. So, we'll replace those with some better ones. That's not the issue. The issue is, even after we uh, fix the broken rollers, uh, they were still no uh, noise. They're still, yeah. There's a noise. The a noise that was always there. And I'm and trying to discern what it is. Yeah, it's I'm not from the secondary. It's from the primary. So, we're going to start it up right now and show you what that sounds like. here with the cover off it, it doesn't, doesn't sound, sound loud bad. jangling yeah but there's definitely something in there we're gonna take it I off i can hear like the faintness of it yeah man what a pain huh want me to hold that light or it can never just throw it. forget that stupid thing all right Ugh. i'm mad too i'm mad too here get this off I also think I got this together wrong. I see an arrow here, which does line up with kind of, but there's an arrow also. Oh yeah, these rollers are destroyed. So I put some kind of junk in there. Okay, and does this? And that one does not line up. So I think I did it wrong. We were, um, I was, I didn't know anything about it until after. Uh... That has nothing to do with these rollers. They're just absolute junk. I don't, some, I don't know what I bought. It may actually have to do with that. I read about it. But we bought some. What's that? Um, I read about like not putting it in properly and how it, it no, those are... puts it off center and uh, yeah. then it can rub. But anyway. That's the next thing. This is. This here, that's what it sounds like. You know, do it fast. But, <laughs> but that's just the weights, which is, uh, you know, it's normal. Is it? Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. But we got to take both these apart. So let's go do that. Okay, let's do it. On to the bench. Let's do the primary first. Okay. Let me turn this off for a second. On the bench. On the bench. All right, so we have the primary. We left our, we have the puller installed, sticking up an inch and a half above. We're going to drop this guy in place. Uh, with, you know, so you have just all these pieces that come with the kit, with the tools. Clutch puller. Clutch kit. Clutch tool kit, you know what I mean. You know, the, the, 
Kill it. Oh my God! Stop! Take that out. All right. So we're gonna pop this thing apart. We have the, we have the clip. The this tool. That thingy. Do we have this one? It's a clutch and a bobber. It's a yeah. It's that one. Anyway, let's do this. Okay. Ready? Yep. Totally. Born ready, actually. Is that normal? Yeah. Oh my God! Did you? That way you didn't tell me that was gonna happen. That's yeah. gonna God. <laughs> Ugh, man, that scared me. No wonder you said you're ready, and you looked. I was like, why are you pausing? Oh, I should always know what you're doing when you do that. You're never. God. I thought you knew. I didn't know. You know what? I did not know. I know now. Oh, good luck trying to scare me again with that. Jeez. Good luck. Okay. Don't even talk about not try. I'm not daring you. I think I have an idea already of what the noise is. Uh-oh. I'll show you in a minute. So we'll come back in a minute. Okay. All right. Okay. So? So, all right. So we have this mark just so it, we put it back together the way it was. Right. Um, we're going to lift this out of here. Okay. But we need a... Uh, what do you need? Hey. A lifter, my Bob? So... Taking the floor, my bob out. Then you twist the thing, bop, bop. Then you make the pop, and then you take the part, bop, bop. It's a lot of fun. Let's lift this out. Okay. Yeah, and there Danger. goes all of our. Hey, Danger. Tyler. This would be a good time to put uh, those O rings in, huh? Uh. Yeah. I bet we don't have them. Uh, can I get them? Yeah, and I think I just lost. All right, so we're just checking these weights. I feel like we have a little bit of a slop side to side, which is probably our noise. I'm gonna talk to some clutch people tomorrow. I'm gonna talk to Tom Casper, actually. Yeah, do that. So, yeah, we're gonna have to dig into this. So it's not just gonna be a- But I'm pretty sure it's these weights that are making the noise. Wrong. You ordered the right, the good ones, and then they weren't going to be here in time, so we had to do what we had to do. Yep. It got us through the desert. It did. We're going to look. Uh, we're going to look up this whole thing, but we have an arrow here, which is supposed to have a con uh, corresponding arrow here. But I'm thinking maybe that arrow was supposed to be there also. Uh, we're going to find out. And How we'll, we were tired that night. This this happens. And I know we're going to have 47 different experts on here telling us all about it. Which, thank That's you for fine. that. That's thank good. you. Thank you. We do appreciate it. He just sounds like he doesn't, but he's tired. And I he's, didn't mean it. <laughs> he just wants to be done. Well, it depends, you know. It's the one that are actually trying to reach out and help and give advice like we would give people. Yeah. Versus the ones that are like, you're an idiot. Yeah. Told you, bro. Yeah. Idiot. Can't I'm sucks. Yeah, i tell you something. If you're doing something for the first time and you don't, don't do it right, it doesn't necessarily make you an idiot. No. Just make sure you're in a right? And also, we saw what happens. Uh, and none of you, you guys, don't lie to me right now. How many of you read the instructions? That's all I'm going to say. Just out of curiosity, let's take a look real quick. Here. Okay. So rollers destroyed. I think they're just junk. I, I don't know. I don't wow, start. that's a bad deal. Uh, okay. All right, we're gonna put a little bit of grease on these threads. It is a good idea. Doesn't mean we won't need heat, that's for sure. But all right, ready? Yep. Okay. We're gonna see if we get the good pop. That's not the good pop. Mm -mm. Or wait, maybe something just shifted. Oh, maybe. Is it really coming out? We just had these out, so maybe we're gonna get lucky because we just had them out. Huh. You just need to shut up. Oh, I see it coming out. Really? What the heck? Something went. All right. <laughs> so we got that one loose. Check this out. Okay. 
Watch this. Oh, okay, I can do. Amazing. Remember in that last video how we're like, hey, you need a blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. Ooh. What are those? Oh, my God. Right? Right? Let's try it our new punch. I don't get to ha hammer or do anything in this garage for a couple weeks. I think I got grounded from touching tools and from using things. Right. When you cut an artery, you're banned. It's like the smallest artery you have, probably. Is that working? Right. I'm only it looking is. for the camera, so... Oh, I see. Okay, okay. Yep, it's coming. All right. So good job on those. All right, so let's get the rest of them out. Okay. And uh, and then we'll come back when we have parts, I guess, because I think we're about done. I don't know. All right, so this is combination uh, prepping for Glamis, loading for Glamis, heading to Glamis, part of the trip, whatever you want to call it. But it's also the end of uh, this clutch video. Finally, uh, I think we're gonna I think we're gonna get it right this time. So what we got here is we got this bag right here. In this bag right here, we have a magical thing that we need. Let me show you. On the bench, we have a mess. Which will all get resolved tonight. So, for any of you that have watched our recent videos, uh, we were working on the clutch. We ran into some issues on the secondary, right? And those issues were that one of the pins was stuck. We ended up having to cut it out. Took a grinder, cut, 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 knocked it out, knocked it out, all good, right? Uh, in the meantime, we have some uh, pins that are, that one's a little chewed up. That one's probably a little chewed up. We broke some rollers and whatnot. That's okay, because look at this. New rollers, new rollers. Are these OEM, what are they? We'll look at these later. Uh, these are warranty killer rollers. These are new pins for the rollers. Okay, warranty killer rollers. That's what's gonna go in this thing. So we're gonna do that right now. Uh, Brandy will be here soon to help us out. We'll get this car done. It's time to load up. We're leaving tomorrow after work. That means we have right now to get this car done loaded up. We need to put the clutch together. We need to put it on the 100 octane tune because we're gonna run that tune this time. We got our belts, we got antennas, we got Helmets, we got all the stuff. Uh, we got the box on loaded with tools, whatnots. I think we're ready to go. Let's do this thing. Okay, so we got all the pins out. Um, I was noticing, I think it was yesterday, this hole right here is a little bit, uh, I don't know, it's a little bit banged up. So, I don't know, we just got to keep our eye out on that. And this one, so we're just going to kind of clean that edge up just a little bit so it's not so banged up. Might be time for a new clutch, but, you know, right now we got to get, we got to get on the road. So we're going to deal with that later. So here's end result. Uh, I didn't show a lot of the process, maybe some of it, but basically we put in brand new uh, warranty killer rollers that we got from Tom Casper at SD UTV. Uh, we appreciate it much. Brushed us out some parts that we needed. Uh, basically this stuff here. Here's the package from it. But he rushed it out, rushed us out some bolts, pins, roller pins, whatever you call them. They're called bolts in the manual, uh, and he rushed us out the rollers. So we got this thing all back together. Hopefully we're good this time. We have the primary over here. We're going to put it back together. So for the results on how this goes, uh, go check out our next video where we're in Glamis, Freester. That's coming up. Thanks. Later.